Hello there, health enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Have you ever wondered about the foods you should avoid if you have kidney problems? Well, you're in luck because in this video, I'm going to reveal the top 11 foods that you might want to steer clear of. But before we dive in, make sure to smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Trust me, you won't want to miss them. Our bodies are intricate machines, and every part needs to function correctly for the whole system to run smoothly. Among these essential components, our kidneys quietly and efficiently clear our bodies of toxins, making them the unsung heroes of our health. But did you know that what you eat can significantly impact the health of these vital organs? In this eye-opening video, we'll unveil 11 everyday foods that might be secretly sabotaging your kidney health. Whether you're looking to boost your kidney's well-being or have been advised to follow a kidney-friendly diet, this is your ultimate guide. 1. Pickles Let's kick things off with a beloved food item that often adorns our tables and sandwiches, pickles. As tantalizing as their tangy taste may be, it's worth noting that these briny delights can potentially have a detrimental effect on our kidneys. The main concern with pickles, and a reason those with kidney troubles might want to avoid them, is their high sodium content. You see, when we indulge in salty foods like pickles, it makes it harder for our kidneys to remove the excess salt from our bodies. This can lead to sodium retention and, subsequently, cause a rise in blood pressure, putting extra strain on your kidneys over time. High blood pressure can harm the nephrons, the tiny units inside your kidney responsible for cleaning your blood. Moreover, the vinegar used in pickling can also have a harmful effect. It is a source of acid that, when consumed in large quantities, can disrupt your body's pH balance, making it more difficult for your kidneys to maintain equilibrium. This can lead to kidney stones, another foe you want to avoid. 2. Avocados Now let's talk about a food that might come as a surprise, especially given its recent reputation as a superfood avocados. These green wonders are known for being rich in healthy fats and nutrients, making them a favorite among health-conscious eaters. However, for those with kidney problems, avocados can present some challenges. The primary concern here is their high potassium content. In normal amounts, potassium is essential for our bodies, helping maintain electrical gradients in our cells and performing various important functions. However, when your kidneys aren't functioning at their best, they might struggle to remove excess potassium from your blood. This can lead to a condition known as hyperkalemia, which, if left unmanaged, can cause heart rhythm problems and, in extreme cases, cardiac arrest. Avocados also pack quite a caloric punch, with a single fruit containing over 200 calories. While they are loaded with those healthy fats and fiber, their calorie content can contribute to weight gain if consumed in excess. Overweight and obesity are risk factors for kidney disease, as they increase the strain on your kidneys and force them to work harder to filter out toxins from your body. 3. Red meat. Moving on to our third dietary pitfall, red meat. Steak, hamburgers, and various cuts of beef have long been a staple in the diets of many. But it turns out that too much red meat might not be the best choice for your kidneys. On the surface, Red meat seems like a great source of protein, not to mention other essential nutrients like iron and vitamin B12. However, there's a catch. Red meat is incredibly high in protein. While protein is undoubtedly essential for our overall health, too much of it can increase the metabolic load on your kidneys. When your kidneys are already compromised, a high-protein diet can cause them to work even harder to remove the waste products of protein metabolism, including urea and uric acid. This extra load can accelerate the progression of kidney disease in those who already have weakened kidney function. But it doesn't stop there. Red meat is also notorious for being a significant source of saturated fats, the kind that can elevate the levels of bad LDL cholesterol in your body. This, in turn, contributes to the buildup of plaques in your arteries, a condition known as atherosclerosis. This arterial narrowing can lead to high blood pressure, which is a well-established risk factor for kidney disease. 4. Spinach Our journey to kidney-friendly eating continues as we make our way to our fourth food item, and this one might come as a bit of a surprise. Isn't spinach supposed to be one of the healthiest foods out there? Indeed, it is. 
Spinach is celebrated for its incredible nutrient profile. It's loaded with vitamins, minerals, and fiber that promote overall wellness. However, when it comes to kidney health, there are a few important things to consider. Spinach, particularly when consumed raw or lightly cooked, is remarkably high in potassium and oxalates. These may sound like fancy terms, but they play a critical role in how spinach can impact your kidneys. Let's start with potassium. As we mentioned earlier, potassium is a vital mineral for various body functions. But for individuals with kidney problems, high potassium content can be problematic. When your kidneys can't efficiently filter excess potassium from your blood, it can lead to dangerous heart rhythm irregularities. In extreme cases, this can be life-threatening. But that's not all. Spinach also contains oxalates, which are natural compounds found in certain foods. When consumed in large amounts, oxalates can crystallize and form kidney stones. These tiny, rock-hard deposits can lead to excruciating pain and even cause damage to the kidneys. So, for those prone to forming kidney stones or with existing kidney disease, consuming high oxalate foods like spinach may not be the best choice. However, keep in mind that spinach is a superfood with a wealth of nutrients and should not be entirely eliminated from your diet. The key here is moderation, especially if you've been advised to follow a low potassium or low oxalate diet due to kidney health concerns. 5. Beans and Lentils as we continue our exploration of foods that can impact your kidney health, we come to an unexpected player in the kidney conundrum, beans and lentils. These humble legumes are celebrated for being essential sources of plant-based protein, fiber, and various nutrients. However, if you have kidney concerns, these wholesome foods need to be approached with a bit of caution. Here's why. Beans and lentils are packed with nutritional goodness, but they also come with high levels of potassium and phosphorus two minerals that can pose a problem for individuals with compromised kidney function. As we've discussed earlier, when your kidneys aren't functioning at their best, they may struggle to filter out excess potassium and phosphorus from your blood. High levels of these minerals can affect your body's ability to use calcium, leading to bone problems, itchy skin, and even hardening of the arteries, a serious risk factor for heart disease. But keep in mind, Beans and lentils are generally nutritious and can be a part of a balanced diet, even if you have kidney concerns. Your doctor may advise you to reduce their potassium and phosphorus content by soaking, sprouting, or boiling them. Additionally, while beans and lentils have numerous health benefits, they can cause digestive problems in some people due to a type of carbohydrate that's hard for our bodies to break down, leading to gas and bloating. So while these legumes can be highly nutritious, they should be consumed with caution if you have kidney concerns, and it's a good idea to prepare them properly to minimize potential side effects. 6. Bananas Our journey through kidney-friendly eating leads us to a favorite fruit of many, the humble banana. Nutritious, portable, and delicious, bananas are a staple in many diets. However, they may not be the best choice for individuals with kidney issues. Here's why. Bananas are exceptionally high in potassium, one medium-sized banana can contain as much as 422 milligrams of potassium, which is a significant amount, especially for those with kidney problems. While most people can safely enjoy bananas and benefit from their rich vitamin and mineral content, individuals who have been advised to follow a low-potassium diet due to kidney problems may need to limit or avoid them. In addition to the high potassium content, bananas, and to a certain extent, orange juice, contain potassium in significant amounts. For individuals who need to manage their potassium intake carefully, limiting these fruits may be necessary. However, keep in mind that unless you've been specifically advised to limit potassium intake due to kidney concerns, or you have other health issues related to acidity or oxalates, there's no need to banish bananas from your diet. 7. Tomatoes. Advancing to our seventh food item, let's talk about a staple in many of our kitchens, the versatile and flavorful tomato. While tomatoes are generally healthy and packed with beneficial nutrients, there are certain circumstances, particularly concerning kidney health, where caution is needed. Tomatoes are rich in potassium. One medium-sized tomato can contain as much as 292 milligrams of this vital mineral. For most people, tomatoes are a delicious and nutritious addition to many dishes. However, 
Individuals with kidney problems may need to monitor their tomato consumption, as high potassium levels can be problematic. Just like in the case of bananas, for those who have been advised to follow a low-potassium diet due to kidney health concerns, limiting tomato intake may be necessary. Additionally, tomatoes contain a fair amount of oxalates, which are natural compounds found in various foods. Consuming too many oxalates can lead to the formation of kidney stones in susceptible individuals. These stones can cause severe pain and damage to the kidneys, so it's essential to consider your oxalate intake, especially if you are prone to forming kidney stones or have existing kidney disease. Remember, though, that tomatoes are generally a healthy food, loaded with essential nutrients like vitamin C, lycopene, and other antioxidants. If you don't have specific dietary restrictions related to kidney health, tomatoes can still be a valuable addition to your diet. 8. Dairy Products Now let's explore the eighth item on our list, dairy products. While dairy is celebrated as an excellent source of essential nutrients like calcium and vitamin D, it could potentially pose challenges for those with kidney issues. One of the primary reasons for concern is that dairy products are high in phosphorus. While phosphorus is essential for bone health, the kidneys of individuals with kidney disease can't efficiently remove excess phosphorus from the body. This can lead to high phosphorus levels in the blood, which can pull calcium from your bones, making them weak and prone to fractures. Excess phosphorus can also result in itchy skin and, at very high levels, hardening of the arteries, increasing the risk of heart disease. Dairy products are also significant sources of protein, and while protein is an essential nutrient, too much of it can be problematic when your kidneys are compromised. This is because the kidneys have to work harder to eliminate the waste products of protein metabolism, which constrain these already weakened organs. Additionally, dairy products are often high in saturated fats, which can contribute to heart disease by raising your LDL cholesterol levels. Moreover, they can lead to digestive issues in individuals who are lactose intolerant, resulting in symptoms like bloating, diarrhea, and gas. While dairy products undoubtedly have their place in a balanced diet, it's important to consume them in moderation, particularly if you have kidney problems. Opting for lower phosphorus dairy options or plant-based alternatives can be a wiser choice for those looking to protect their kidney health. 9. Oranges our ninth food to consider is a citrus favorite for many, oranges. Known for their high vitamin C content and refreshing taste, oranges are generally seen as a healthy choice. Still, if you're dealing with kidney issues, you might want to reconsider. Oranges, along with orange juice, are high in potassium. A medium-sized orange can contain as much as 237 milligrams of potassium, and a cup of orange juice can have up to 496 milligrams. While potassium is an essential mineral for various bodily functions, individuals who have been advised to follow a low-potassium diet due to kidney problems may need to limit their orange consumption. In addition to their potassium content, oranges are acidic, which can trigger heartburn or acid reflux in individuals prone to these conditions, causing discomfort. Furthermore, oranges can contribute to the formation of kidney stones in susceptible individuals as they contain certain types of oxalates that combine with calcium in the urine and form stones. Despite these potential issues, oranges offer numerous health benefits, including a powerful dose of immune-boosting vitamin C. So, unless you've been specifically advised to limit potassium intake due to kidney concerns or you have other health issues related to acidity or oxalates, there's no need to banish oranges from your diet. For most of us, oranges can continue to be a delightful and nutritious addition to our daily intake. 10. Processed meats. At number 10, we have a category that's often a guilty pleasure for many processed meats. These include foods like ham, bacon, sausage, hot dogs, and deli meats. While these processed delights might be delicious and convenient, they could potentially spell trouble for your kidneys. Processed meats are typically high in sodium. Excessive sodium intake can lead to raised blood pressure levels, and high blood pressure is a leading cause of kidney damage. Over time, the increased pressure can overwork and strain the kidneys, leading to reduced kidney function. Furthermore, processed meats often have a high protein content, which, while generally a healthy nutrient, can pose challenges when consumed in excess. 
Excessive protein intake can increase the metabolic load on your kidneys, causing them to work harder to eliminate the waste products of protein metabolism. Processed meats are also often high in saturated and trans fats, which can increase the risk of heart disease by raising your LDL cholesterol levels. Additionally, they have been classified as a group 1 carcinogen, meaning there's strong evidence that they can cause cancer. In the context of overall health, it's recommended to limit the consumption of processed meats and opt for lean, unprocessed meats or plant-based protein sources instead. 11. Canned soups and ready meals. And finally, at number 11, we have canned soups and ready meals. These convenience foods may be a lifesaver when you're short on time, but they may not be the best choice if you're concerned about your kidney health. Here's why. One of the main issues with canned soups and ready meals is their typically high sodium content. These products often contain added salt to enhance flavor and extend shelf life. While convenient, excessive sodium consumption can lead to elevated blood pressure levels. High blood pressure is a leading cause of kidney damage, as the increased pressure can overwork and strain the kidneys, ultimately leading to reduced kidney function. Additionally, these convenience foods often contain various food additives and preservatives. Some of these additives have been linked to kidney damage. For instance, phosphates are commonly used in processed foods to enhance flavor and preserve freshness. Aside from kidney health, these additives can sometimes lack essential nutrients and can be high in unhealthy fats and sugars, which can contribute to weight gain, heart disease, and type 2 diabetes. Furthermore, some people may be allergic or sensitive to certain food additives and preservatives, experiencing symptoms like headaches, bloating, and fatigue. While canned soups and ready meals can provide a quick and easy meal solution, it's best to limit their consumption, especially if you're mindful of your kidney health. Opting for fresh, home-cooked meals whenever possible gives you control over the ingredients and nutrient content, promoting both your kidney health and overall well-being. So there you have it, a comprehensive journey through the 11 foods to avoid or limit if you have concerns about your kidney health. Remember that what you put into your body can have a profound impact on your health, and your kidneys play a pivotal role in your overall well-being. While these foods can potentially impact kidney health, most of them have their place in a balanced, nutritious diet when consumed in moderation and with the right preparation. If you have kidney concerns, it's always best to talk to your doctor or a dietitian who can provide personalized advice based on your health condition and dietary needs. Never forget that the essence of a healthy diet is balance, variety, and moderation. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. We always strive to bring you the best health tips and insights to ensure your journey to wellness is well-informed and enjoyable. You have the power to influence your health with every bite you take, so choose wisely, live well, and until next time, stay healthy.